Right guys, so we're still on the Isle of Wight trip. We've pulled up just before we head into the next location. It is a huge manor house and it is said to be one of the most haunted. Locals say that they hear screams, see apparitions in the window. And when you see this place, you'll understand it is creepy as. Yeah, so we've actually done a bit of research on this woman to see if we can find anything else, haven't we? Um, not just your average research, ancestry.co.uk level research. Yeah, we've gone for it. We found out she was an American woman and she died in 2005 and on a death certificate, the cause of death was suicide. Obviously, that's all we know. We don't know any of the gory details. So we're going to go into her house again, aren't we? Have a little look around, see what we can find. Yeah, so it's just two minutes up the road now. We're going to head inside. Going to have a little bit of an explore, have a look around. We did go in there this afternoon just to get any names for research or anything. But we'll have a little explore, we'll head inside, and then we'll have a little investigation. Hopefully we pick up something good, and it should be an interesting one. So we'll see you up there. So it should just be up here on the left. It is opposite a prison. When the building was first made, it was made for a prison warden. See the prison walls on the right now? This place is so creepy, look how dark this lane is. Just be up on the left here now. There it is. Right, so we need to park up here. We'll park up here in these woods. Not creepy at all. No. <laughs> Prison gates. Prison, yeah. Luckily we can just go straight outside this one. Are you scared? Yeah, a little bit. I am too. <laughs> So what is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, Isle of Wight, most haunted island in the world. And we're about to head inside one of the most haunted houses on the island. Huge manor house, as Lisa said a minute ago. Stories of suicide in the house, the old owner. It has been built, I think it was 1800s, this manor. It was built for a prison warden. So it has a lot of history on it and stuff like that. We're gonna head inside now. My arse is twitching already. So hope you enjoy it guys, remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit notification for future explores. This place is going to be insane. Let's get it. So we're outside the manor now, look at the size of this place. Absolutely unreal. You ready for this? Big, eerie, dark, exactly what we like. So we'll keep these lights down until we head inside, innit? Yeah. Let's go. Nice, easy entry for a change. Oh, the floor's a bit sketchy. Check this out. You alright? There you go. <laughs> so we are inside the house now guys. The bottom few floors are pretty bare. But what we're going to do, we're going to have the K2 going from the start. And we're going to have the Spirit Talker app going from the start as well. And then we're going to work our way up. Up to the rooms where we believe she killed herself. And then we're going to do our necrophonic concession and stuff like that inside. You ready? Yes. This is a nice kitchen though. It is, isn't it? Yeah. It's quite modern for the type of house it is. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> I'll get this spirit talker going. It will shout a few words out as we're going. Spirit talker app. What? Not the curtain freaking out. Curtain freaking you out. Already. Right, so Spirit Talker app's going. A few dishes and stuff, isn't there? Look at that curtain twitching as well. Freaking you out. Yeah. Just seeing if there's anything in these cupboards. I checked all that today. <laughs> They're all empty? Yeah. There's like a dishwasher in here too. You can tell it was an old house though, can't you? Yeah. That would have had a proper nice auger in there at one point. Yeah. Look at the cobwebs and mummified spiders <gasps> above us. Oh my 
But check out this artwork here as well. It's got Jessica on here. Utility room. The law to check the fridges, guys, we know this. Oh, that's rank. Gala? Shooting. Oh. Shooting. Whew. I forgot that was on then, that that's actually good. scared when me. I think about it when it's on. <laughs> oh, the fridge stinks. It does. There's so many rooms here, though, isn't there? Hey, check these. I respect you. I respect you, it says. So that's just going to fire words out. Look at that hot old photos. Dresses. You're nervous. Huh? Yeah, you are. <laughs> Let's check these rooms out. They are quite grand rooms, aren't they? Big high ceilings. Yeah, big curtains as well. Yeah. yeah. All boarded up. There has been, looks like a lot of vandalism, doesn't it? Yeah. Check these fireplaces and everything. Myself. Myself. Check these cobwebs. Ooh. Everything's echoing in here as well. How big these rooms are. I'm a bit freaked out, you know. I'm a bit freaked out. What about you? I'm over here. I'm over here. I was just gonna say I'm over here. <laughs> there you go, she's here. Look at these stairs, oh my god. I wonder if it's got a basement or anything. This floor's caving in here, so you have to be watch out. Oh, check these rooms out. That ceiling rose. Hey, look at this. Oh, look. It's a baby book. Oh, my God. Our oh, baby treasured memories. Oh. <gasps> the f Katie's going mad. The phones are on airplane Four. mode. Red. Right, okay. So that's going off now. We'll Power. Power. Try the lights. What lights? No. The lights on the ceiling. Just do the light switch, see if there's anything. No. Oh my god, Adam. And I come up, whoa. Goose with my legs. Nothing. Yeah. It's by the baby book, isn't it? Every time I come Little. Back. Little. Look at it. Yeah. Oh, look, it's still got the uh, 1972. Oh, my God. The hospital bracelets. Yeah. Wow. How crazy is this? Don't worry. I know. That's cool, isn't it? Yeah. I'll leave that where we found it. Oh. So it said power, little, I'm over here. What's that for? I know, yeah. I will talk to you. I will talk to you. <laughs> we'll talk to you. We'll just have a little walk round first. Oh, look at the mould. This house is so creepy. Shh. Like a whisper or something then. Shh. Shh. What's under here? Nothing, I was hoping like a basement or something. Can you close down because it's where you put your coats? Yeah. There's a the front door. I know, yeah. Head up these stairs. Yeah. 
Right guys, I don't know if this is coming across, but this is a creepy old house. It's absolutely massive. This spirit talk is going off. I will talk to you in that. We are going to try and communicate in a bit with the Necrophonic app. But look at these big old rooms. Yeah. It is quite bare until you get into the attic, isn't it? Yeah. But we'll have a look. Oh, corridors are freaking. Nasty. So, you think some of the nasties in here? Maybe. Is it going off? Yeah, a little bit, isn't it? Yeah. Nana. Nana. Is that your Nana? Setting the K2 off? Shame that the windows have been smashed and that, isn't it? Yeah. A few bits, old dresses and that. Are we footsteps? Yeah. I heard footsteps then. Hello? Hello? Looks like someone's been in stealing copper. Thanks. Thanks. Might be saying thanks for saying hello. Maybe. Just wish that oh, for thanks for stealing me copper. <laughs> My arse dropped then. What? Why did you The reflection on the window of your legs. My whole body shut down. Stop doing that. Right. I thought someone was out on the roof. <sighs> Did you see it in the window? I can see it now. Oh my days. Especially after that. I think this is the children's room. So if you check this, look. It's them. Oh, it's going. As I'm looking at the stickers. Still going. It's getting a bit of activity this way, isn't yeah. it? I said this is the children's room. It's them. And then that just went off a little bit. Is it still doing it? Not at the minute, no. No. Oh, little flickers every now and then. Yeah. Right guys, we're going to head up to the attic now. There's a few bits left up there to have a look through. This is where we found the details for who lived here and stuff like that. But check out what you've got to go through. It's like a proper secret door. Children. Are the children up here? Who's that? Oh no. <laughs> My nemesis. Just greeted me on the stairs. Ooh. Alright, up in the attic now. It's not just any attic, look at this. It's absolutely massive. Don't move. Don't move. Don't move it said. <laughs> you need to work on your legs. But check this, absolutely everything's left up here. All the bits and bobs. Little books and that. We'll just have a walk through and then see what else we can find, yeah? Look, these are obviously the old bedrooms. Check this out. An old wedding photograph. 
There's like Judge. What does that say? Raymond. Raymond. Is Raymond here with us? Could be. Did you marry a Raymond? <sighs> Maybe. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah. We've got a um, spare pair of underpants there, so I may need them. When you need them. I may need them. But check this look. Royal Air Force books. I just had a proper. See if it start blowing now. Royal Air Force book. Got old, old coats. Oh my god. <laughs> Someone's tried burning it as well. Yeah. There's a few dollars hidden in this little pile. There is, they can barely the stay there. Yeah. Return of the Seven, there's all vinyls, old magazines. Check this old suitcase. There is quite a bit of. Look at the haircuts they used to have here. Mental. What's that? A diary. A cookery book. A cookbook. Yeah. Everything echoes, doesn't it, up here? It happened here. It happened here? Oh my days. They're collecting dolls. Ooh, I'm not collecting nothing. I don't yeah. want it. It happened here, it said. May hung us off. Up in these attics. But look, there's uh, quite a lot left up here as well. One thousand nine hundred twenties. 1920s. That would have been, I was going to say when the house was built, but I think it's a bit earlier than that. Check out this old vinyl it's player. Years, wasn't it? Yeah. Why did you hear that? Matthew. Did you hear that? Yeah. Might be the wind. There is all sorts of beer, isn't there? I'm getting caught up in everything. Got quite a lot of activity by that uh, children's book, didn't we, downstairs? Yeah, this has just gone back to normal now. Has it? But by that book, it was fully red, wasn't it? Yeah. Check this room out, guys. The old Confederate flag. That's taboo as anything now, isn't it? We don't mess with stuff like that these days. Actually, I don't actually know the whole story about that, so if anyone can let me know why they're actually banned. We're in the UK, we don't actually get told stuff like that. I just know that they're bad now. Oh, but look at all the stuff. Lie? When I was talking about the lie. Well, what do we have here? The Little Mermaid. The old photographs. Here, look, that's outside. Because of prison walls. Oh, yeah. yeah. Check all these out, guys. The wedding photos. There is quite a lot up here, isn't there? Any dates on those papers? Yeah, 1987. 1987? Wow. It's on these old ones and then it was 1994. George. George. It's thrown a lot of names out, but there was quite a lot of names, uh, quite a lot of people on those wedding photos, wasn't there? But this is crazy. So strange to see the old Confederate flag in the UK. Yeah. Saying that though, I found Confederate money in the past. The old South is moving to the UK. Right, so UK 2's going off. I'm speaking. My name's Adam. Just come to have a look around. That was going off then. It went to red when you were moving. 
Tô pra que não? Você tem nada a fazer? Não. Eu tô tentando pegar o que eu tô fazendo. Eu acho que eu tenho isso na câmera. Você acha? Eu acho que sim. Oh, aquele doll só me freaked me out. Eu esqueci que ele estava lá. Sim, eu fiz. Yes, I did. Right, guys, we had a look round. I think the most activity was where the baby photo was, wasn't it? Yeah, 100%. But as we were up here, it said it happened here. So I think I want to start the necrophonic here and then maybe move down to that room. I think that's a good idea, especially with us saying it happened here. And there's quite a lot of personal effects as well, so it might be good to start it here and then move down. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so get a spirit talker off. Necrophonic. Like a necrophonic. It scares you, doesn't it? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go where I can see these stairs just in case someone decides to come up and scare me. I can see out the window then as well. Alright, so you ready? Just do a little go in here and then we'll head down to the other room. Yeah? Right guys, we're going to start it now. So is there any spirits in this house that would like to talk to us? You said it happened here when we were up here. Can you tell us what happened? The end, that sound again. Can you confirm if you're the woman that lives in the house? Were you the woman that died in the house? That's Can you tell us how you were killed? Can you tell us how it was the end? Whilst we were downstairs, you said the children. Is there any children spirits here? Yes. Can you tell us the names of the children? No. Can you tell us why there's children here? Was there children killed in the house? That was the same voice whispering then. So I'm going to ask again, can you tell us if you're the woman that killed herself in this house? You asked before as well who was talking. I'd like you to talk to me. My name's Adam. This is Lisa. That's going off. K2 is going off, guys. There's like a lot of voices, isn't there? Yeah. This is freaky. K2 is going off. I'm curious to know about the children. We didn't hear of any children that died here, but you've said the children, there's a lot of toys. Can you tell us anything about the children? Is this Ravia? Ravia is the name of the woman that lived here. Is this someone impersonating Ravia? Yeah. So whoever's impersonated, can you tell us your name? Come on, you said you talked to us, let's get some clear voices. That's 
Stop immer noch. I don't know. Sometimes I can't make it out. I have to work it out when I'm editing. K2 is still going off up here. Right, I'm going to stop this now. Yeah, there is a hell of a lot of voices and I'm feeling quite freaked out up here at the moment. I can't take my hands off that ball either. It's proper freaking me out. So yeah, what do you reckon? Head down to that baby book. Yeah. Yeah. Whilst in the baby book room we had recorded a full 15 minute necrophonic session and had some amazing results. We were told the name of the spirit that was impersonating who we believed to be the owner of the house. A voice repeatedly said Stephanus, which upon research I found apparently is the demon of Raph. It wasn't until I was editing this video that I found the whole necrophonic session from that room had a corrupted audio file and instead of our own audio I found 15 minutes of this strange sound. I wouldn't normally upload an incomplete vlog, but with the results we had, I still wanted to show you guys this amazing place. What is also very strange is once we left the room, the camera and audio worked perfectly again. Was this a random corrupted file that had never happened to me before? Or did someone not want what was said in that room repeated again? <laughs>